everyone, I'm Kevin. I'm going to talk about Aurora. Um, so this is our big kind of unveiling. Um, this is a project, uh, this is a framework that we run at Twitter. Um, it's our biggest uh, user of our Mesos clusters. And we've uh, been working over the past few months uh, very hard to get it uh, kind of in a state where we can share it with the world. And this is it. So just jumping in, Aurora runs Twitter. We've run it in production since 2011. Um, it's handled several types of failures very, very well. Um, services that run on uh, Aurora, managers, managed by Aurora, uh, have dealt with these failures that have just taken down like um, the, rest of, the rest of the world. Um, it's also used daily by a huge portion of the company. Um, it's used basically to deploy everything of uh, a lot of very important applications at Twitter. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to jump into a demo. Uh, so this is now up on GitHub. Uh, you can go to, uh, you'll see the URL in a bit, um, but you can actually bring up a full cluster and uh, go play with it. So this is, I'm going to, so we just got this working two hours ago, so <laughs> this is ho hopefully going to work, hopefully going to work. So uh, I've already created these VMs, um, so I'll just show you Vagrant status, shows me what's running, yeah. So I've got uh, a Zookeeper VM to coordinate everything, a Mesos master, a Mesos slave uh, to actually run the things, and then the Aurora scheduler, which will actually uh, be what uh, coordinates, coordinates everything. So I'm going to go ahead and go into my Aurora scheduler. And so I'm going to show you how we actually define services at Twitter. So services are the, the uh, description of how you run a service is just code that you check in. We have a uh, Python domain-specific language uh, that allows you to configure this. So this is under uh, examples, jobs. It's right here. Um, you can see it's kind of, it's kind of weird looking. Uh, we have a huge document uh, on all the various things you can do with this. So this is just a very basic example. I'm just going to have a hello world thing that echoes to the, uh, to the standard out. Um, I define how many resources I want to use. And then I define kind of where to run uh, the, where to run everything. So I'm going to go ahead and create this job. And so that is example data prod hello. And so that's going to create. So that's going to be running in my Aurora cluster. In just a second. Oh, almost, almost did it, almost did it. Uh, let's see if my scheduler is actually running, not in there. That's my, that's my slide deck. Um, oh, my scheduler is not running. Maybe I should run it. It really did. Um, let's see if that does it. It's already running. No, it's not. <sighs> Let's see if that made it run. No. Oh, no, no. All right, well, that's a pretty short demo then. Um, <laughs> so I'm not going to live debug this on stage. Uh, so <laughs> instead, I'm going to just tell you uh, what would have happened. Um, so. Uh, after we submit that, um, the scheduler kind of very quickly will send that, send that job off to a slave to be executed. Um, we can see, hopefully, there's a slave running. Um, so that's not what I wanted to do. Google there. Uh, so this is my Mesos master right here. Um, and it's, see, there is a scheduler running. Um, so, and it looks like it did actually submit that job off, so let's just see if we can see it. Maybe I have, maybe I have something after all. Um, so we can see the... Double... Yeah, there it is. So I can see, I can see my hello uh, task. I can see um, all the information about it. Normally, I'd be able to get through this uh, directly just following the links in Aurora. Um, I can see things like standard out, standard error. 
Nothing on standard error, which is good. Standard out is just hello forever. And uh, that's, that's the demo. So that's the uh, full cluster. Um, I can show you the lifecycle management stuff that the Aurora command uh, has built into it, um, if it was working. Um, and so that's our demo. Uh, so I just want to close off by acknowledging um, it took a lot of people to get to here. Um, like I said, it's been in production since 2011. There are 24, or 47 total committers on this, on this project that have contributed throughout the life of it. Um, we've actually pushed the entire history of the project to GitHub so you can see every individual commit and how they were, basically how it came to be. Uh, huge thanks to everyone. And then getting involved, uh, you can check out the project website. Uh, we're on uh, we're on the Apache. Uh, we've just launched that website. Uh, it'll be improved soon. We also are up, are, are up on GitHub. Uh, and you can uh, check out the README there, and then we'll try and uh, if you see if you have any bug fixes or issues, which I imagine there will be some, uh, go ahead and uh, file file there um, or tweet at Apache Aurora. That's the demo. Thank you.